What is up, everybody? Sfeinson here, back with another MLB 9 Innings video. We got uh, plenty of stuff to do here on the Washington deck. We got, let's see, we should be sitting at 200 BD pieces. That is a great increase for George Brett, the reason we're going with him. Uh, even though we still have Chipper and left un-Black Diamonded, is because even though he is technically the worst card, you know, between the two, Chipper is just absolutely insane. Uh, Chipper actually has a skill set that runs just fine, whereas George Brett needs a little bit of work on his, and we might as well use that time to try to find Pioneer or Bad Ball Hitter. So, let's see. Uh, complete weekly mission boxes. I have not opened those yet today. Let's see what we get. Over there. Uh, nothing too crazy. We're going to go for skill change tickets. Those would be nice. And let me make sure I don't have a club craft premium skill change ticket. I do not for another six hours. I could have held off, I guess, on filming this video until then. But um, I have time right now. I don't know if I'll be up later to do that so with all that being said i mean let's just kick it off look at all these packs i haven't opened packs in a long time on this account we are going to be special training tony gwynn and obviously keeping an eye out for any vintages uh primes are nice as well but this account doesn't really need them player reserve is full let's go let's toss some special training into tony gwynn Got to get him maxed out. There we go. Take him to level six. Uh, we also have a green ticket that we could throw at him for his 3-3-3 set. I'm on the fence about it. I might want to use it if... Uh... Man, we're... I'm going to have to toss some other stuff in there. Um, kind of on the fence about it. I might want to toss it if George Brett hits something. So we're not going to do that right away. Let's see what else we got to throw at him. Probably just a whole bunch of diamond cards. Yeah, like Max Scherzer. Yeah, he doesn't have super high break. Don't need him. Uh, probably don't need him. The reason I'm checking for high break is for Mentor. And I'm not going to be nerfing a gold pitcher skill, so I don't need to save any pitchers. I already have Ramirez. He has super high break, though. So we're keeping that one. I have one Soto. I may toss those into black diamonding him or save them for upgrades. Do not need Max Scherzer. That's a good card, though. Uh, let's keep on going down. Melanson, I don't think I need, but I'll keep him just to make sure he's not maxed out. Doolittle, we're keeping. And you know what? I'll just burn through this. You guys don't want to hear me sit here and talk about this all day. Uh, keep and to the bottom now. Really, I'm not going to keep too many of these normal cards anyway. I don't plan on buying the SIG pack this month on this account. Um, just because I did so much over on the Cardinals deck. If you haven't seen that video, go ahead and check it out. Uh... we got here 24 players puts us down so we can open up 50 ish 50 ish packs we got 20 silvers Ooh, let's finish these up all right cool Got a bunch of those guys knocked out. I saw a Trevor Hoffman card in there. That's real cool. Oh, we got a diamond first rip. Van Meter 21. You know, thinking back on some of those pitchers I just got rid of, might have been nice to save them for Mentor. Uh, you know, you live and you learn. 
Got some gold cards in there. Got some gold cards. All right, let's go toss these into special training. Yep, just small brain. Oh, we kept a max sure, sir. We got we got some good cards in there. We'll be fine. We will be fine. Auto select my gold, silver, diamond. Uh, Van meter can go. All these guys can go. Nice, up to 110 on Tony Gwynn. Man, I cannot wait till I get that card. Uh, oop, not collection. I always go to collection now. Lineup info. Cannot wait till I get this card, Black Diamond. It's going to be a long time. Um, we're also going to need to throw some GI reset at him. Maybe I have one for purchase I can do. I maxed out the GI on Patrick Corbin doing that. Uh, so he gets Dom bonus now. He's doing fine. Let's see. Let's see if we have a... Nope, available in four days. So we may end up doing that. But let's, in the meantime, just keep burning on through. We got 50 of these, 51 of them. Got another diamond. Nice, nice, nice. And some golds. Golds are good for special training too. Jack Peterson. Then after this, we can use the rest of them to special train George Brett at Black Diamond if this maxes out uh, Tony Gwynn, which I don't think these packs will, but all of them might. Okay, and one last one. Oh, I guess there's only... I guess I misread that. Now it's my one last one. Alright. Cool. Let's go toss it into our special training. Where are we at? Tony Gwynn. Uh, Peterson does not have the stats we're looking for. I don't know who Rogers 21 is. He can go. All right. Yeah, we should be able to max out Tony Gwynn. That'll be nice. All right. We'll be able to do about 40 of these here. I don't know. Let's just let's get these out of the way. Get them out of our inventory. Oh, I can also craft some packs for... Uh, some premiums. Let's do that. It's always good to get premiums. Uh, and we can get a few more for special training. Uh, the special training conversion is a little bad in this game. Like, if you convert to special training silver, you end up actually losing um total special training XP. But look, converting here, I got diamond, which instantly makes up for everything. Uh, I just do it because it saves me time opening and dumping them into special training. Like, honestly, that's what it is. I get enough packs that I'm not worried about that exact conversion. But if you're nickel and diming it, you know, you're, you need every piece of special training you can get. Uh, yeah, you gotta be, gotta be smarter about that. Live season packs. Honestly, I kind of don't want to open up live season packs. Maybe wait till after the season. I kind of wish they'd just throw them in with all the other packs, actually. You know, like live season and silver player packs don't do anything for me. Uh, we got 45 team selectives. Holy cow. I really haven't done anything on this account in a while. I uh, got some diamonds. So what we're going to do here, I'm almost certain we'll max out Tony Gwynn. I am almost positive. Actually, I am positive. Like, we have the diamonds to do it. Uh, wow, nice. Two diamonds out of six packs. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go back to team management. We're going to special upgrade. Tony Gwynn, we're going to max him out. Give him my silver, that, and a diamond. 
Which diamond does it give me? Estrada 22. That's fine. Let's uh, toss them into the special training. And we are up to 111 on Tony Gwynn. That puts him in a really nice spot. Uh, okay. Now, before we toss all the rest into special training, let's go to our inventory so we can special train him and use these BD pieces on Mr. George Brett. And here he is. 200 of them. Perfect. Oh, beautiful. It's always nice to get a new legend to Black Diamond. Man, that farming has been going on for a long, long time. Cool. Uh, okay. 30-ish more packs that we can open. Let's just open 30 of these at a time. I'll also go ahead and open up 30 of these. Yeah. Maybe get lucky and pull a Andre Dawson. That'd be cool. I'm going to have to go through and manually add these to the special training, which is fine. Y'all might find it a little boring. Feel free to skip that part of the video. Uh, feeling a little bit lazy this week, so I don't want to take all the time to edit it out, you know? No legend, Andre Dawson, it seems today. Oh, well, the chance is very, very low anyway. All right, we're working George Brett. Uh, Kaipar Ruiz. Does Cisnero have high break? He does. Okay, he's another one who fits the bill. Wood does not, though. Wood can, Wood can go. Nick Madrigal can go. Stammen, Adon, Turner, Finn, yeah. Uh, we'll keep the Turner just in case we ever pull a Sig. Look at all these silvers. Okay. Don't need. Honestly, just in general, I'm just I might click guys I I end up needing later, but I'm not super worried about it. Again, I get a lot of packs. Mackenzie Gore, 22. You think he's going to have a good year this year? Corbin, we are good on. Maybe we need Rendon. I'm not too pressed about any of this. Finnegan, Gray, Taylor. Just kind of clicking as I see them. Okay, then we're up to the good ones. Nice. Okay, 134 out of 176. That should allow us to finish off this inventory. We're going to leave the team selectives. We're going to leave the vintage packs for double mileage, which is going to be a while away. Max Stassi, 23. Three ultimate team selective packs. Come on, give me a useful diamond and instead I got no diamonds that's what I get for using all my luck on those six packs earlier okay three diamond packs I'm gonna want to keep one because I have a club craft coming up two team selective diamond packs I'm gonna save the wish pack for later this season uh, let's just do two of these Martin and Wade. Okay, nice. Okay, next up, two team selective diamond packs. Let's go for Washington. We're just going to use them all. Not pitcher, batter, select. Give me Doolittle, please. Oh, look at that. That's Doolittle. There it is. Right here. Yes, sir. Look at that. Ooh, baby. That is a good looking card. And then Strasburg, 15. Is that his better year than what I have? I'll have to check. He has some very good years. Uh, that was two incredible pulls. That was two incredible pulls. Like, I honestly, I don't even need to open this. I'm still going to go... I think I'm going to switch to batter, because really I was hunting for Doolittle. Now I have the Strasburg. I have Scherzer and Corbin. There aren't really any other starting pitchers that do it for me. 
uh, relief pitchers. I got the Doolittle. I have Rainy. I have, you know, I have a Legend in there. I have Melanson. I have uh, Chad Cordero. So, yeah, let's go batter. Like, dang. That was a really good team select diamond. And I'm not even stressed about this guy being awful. Fox 22, base 55. Horrible. So we're going to save this. One diamond pack. We're going to save that. Two prime player packs. Here's the first one. Give me a diamond team prime. That'd be excellent. No, we got Lau 21. Dude was a beast. And then we got a gold. Rogers 21. He was also a beast. He's also a, a rookie, so shout out to him. Two signature player packs. Here we go. This is where I get my Trey Turner sig. Opened them both up at the same time. Let's check our stats. Look, uh, con, pow, eye, speed, and field. That is an excellent looking card, actually. That looks really, really good. If I uh, if that were a Cardinals team select, I would say that that's Albert Pujols, honestly. And then a starting pitcher. Starting pitcher goes to Rodriguez, 18. <gasps> no way! No! From a free pack? Excuse me? I scared my cat. Guys! What? Holy cow. Yeah, I'm not even crazy saying those, those are Albert Pujols stats. That's his best year. That is the most insane free pack pull I have ever seen in my life. Holy cow. They just wanted me to get this this great increase on this account, didn't they? Because it worked. What the heck? Oh my god. Okay, we were, let's go lock this up. Let's go lock this up. Oh my goodness. What the f Okay, my animation's frozen. You better lock that up. Com 2. That's so good, guys. That is so good. There he is locked up. You're kidding me. My outfield is about to be loaded. Bryce Harper, Tony Gwynn, and now a Sig Juan Soto that I didn't even buy the TSS. That's who I would have been hoping for from the TSS. That is actually just insane. That is ridiculous. All right. All right, we're going premium skill change tickets. George Brett, let's ride this lightning. Good luck. Chance maker with Slugger Instinct. Not bad. Not good either. That's why we're still rolling, but not bad. Honestly, I'd probably use it over his current set. Spotlight 5 tool. I was wondering if that was going to end up at a good 3-3-3. Three, three, three. Professional ace specialist heavy hitter, you know in this set if we end up not getting anything, maybe it'll be good They're talking about potentially updating some skills to make them more competitive So chance maker uh, May end up being there, but for now it's not there started out with double golds charisma laser beam Unfortunately, those are not what we're looking for. We're gonna use the legend skill change ticket on Max Scherzer to try to get him something better than the bullpen day set that he currently has prediction bm is a little bit worse than his current set dude i still can't believe that Juan soto pull that is all of my luck holy cow what the heck Like I was doing the math in my head. I'm like, man, at max GI, he's like, he's loaded. Okay, no luck on the premiums. 
Uh, let's do regular skill change tickets. So for these, I'm thinking about leaning into Doolittle, although we won't be doing this Juan Soto GI for a little bit. Maybe I do that this episode, and maybe I do that this episode. I do the GI, and then we use these on him, is I think the call. Even though we just got that Doolittle, who I'd also like to get skills, maybe we can get both of them knocked out. Uh, okay. Okay. So, as always, I try to use these legendary skill t tickets to take a decent legend set and find a good one. Um, so, let's see what we get here. Fireballer 113, better than the pitcher's chem, um, but not what we're looking for. So, unfortunate, we'll wait for another 50 of those. We're going to just, we're not even going to bother using greens on it. Uh, we will bother using greens on Mr. Tony Gwynn. Right here, we got the 3-3-3s three, three, protecting Charisma. Let's see what we get. He may end up being awful after this, right? We might get double bronze, but that's a risk we are willing to take. Got to risk it for the biscuit. Yeah, he got pinpoint strike and head on. So he's going to be a lot worse after that, but we can't even complain. I'm telling you, man, that Juan Soto pull is so insane. So let me go get that GI, and I'll be right back, and we'll do that, and we'll do the skill change tickets. All right, so uh, let me collect that. I did a bad thing and forgot to click record when I GI'd. Do I have him in there? No, I don't. When I GI'd Juan Soto. So you guys missed out on that, and I'm sorry about it. Um, that is my bad, but here it is. You also missed the skill change tickets. We didn't get anything good through about 50 of them. <clears throat> so that's just a waste part of the video, and I'm I'm sorry about that, y'all. Uh, I did get him pretty much trained. It's a really good training, nine to the right side. He's going to fit in with my other nine to the right side guys in, uh, you know, Killbrew. How's that going on? Similar train. And I believe Bryce Harper is also 9 to the right. Look at that. So I got three 9 to the right side guys on here, uh, which is real sick. That's more than I have on my main account. Um, so I have to finish up. I have to decide how I want to finish this. It's either 155 power, one maxed out, and 140 contact. Or I can go for 160 power and less contact. Uh, I don't know. I'll have to think about it. Obviously, I can wait for skills. Bad ball hitter, of course, would make low contact make a ton of sense on this guy. So, uh, the only problem I'm running into now is I just don't have any good fielding outfielders to play center. I guess Bryce Harper is my best one. Um, not the end of the world. But, uh, you know, if I wanted higher fielding, I'd train for it. So, that's not a big deal. Uh, so, what I brought you guys here for is to show you that and then I also have two skill change tickets that I can two premiums I can run let's see world baseball classic event oh I probably also have some skill change tickets for you or no I only have 80 coins bummer uh here but from this event I probably have 200 points yeah and so I can use that to get a skill change ticket or a premium then I can do that cla craft I was showing just earlier in the video. We got three more of these. So maybe I shouldn't have used that green on Tony Gwynn. I'm hoping that I did that on camera. I don't actually remember now. Uh, but maybe I should have waited until George Brett. Um, but even if so, I'm, I'm down to wait. I'm not trying to rush this account to being the best, you know, being the best account in the world. Uh, we're going to go here. And actually, I think I'm going to roll on this set. Just what if Chance Maker and their skill update is good? You know, Prediction Charisma is not notably better than Chance Maker Slugger. So. All right, one last one. Charisma Full Swing. A specialist is, you know, if I didn't have to level it, then I might take it over what I have here. Uh, 
All right, so that didn't hit it. So, again, sorry about the skill change tickets. I just, in the GI, just didn't get them. Uh, didn't remember. So, thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a subscribe. Totally insane episode. Let me go put him into the lineup. 118 overall. Man, it makes me... I'm probably going to special train him now before I finish up George Brett, since Brett didn't really get any skills worth talking about. And let's see. His training is going to need a rework. It has the low speed and field, but it has high, higher con than pow, and the, this card definitely doesn't need that going on. We want high pow as possible on George Brett. And we got Tony Gwynn maxed out in the special training department for now which is nice he will need a skill reset um, and that'll put him all over 120s with respect to the compound and i which will be really nice and we'll get him even better later uh when we go and retrain him for his black diamond so thank you all for watching leave a like leave a subscribe leave a comment and i will try to get to it i will talk to you guys well, here, let's compare these real quick. Oh, they're about the same. They are about the same. I will talk to you guys next week.